Hey, what's going on everybody? Shocker Gaming here, bringing us another Madden 20 Ultimate Team video, and today, we just hit level 70, man. We made it. I wanted to show you guys my uh, Redux player. We got the 91 to 92 power-up pass, which is awesome. There's so many good players you can use this pass on, man. But I, the reason why you guys clicked on this video probably is to see that Redux pack, so we're going to go ahead and open it first. I am nervous, man. This could be like a million coin pull, or this could be a 100k pull. All right, man, I'm curious. Oh, there's no... There's no pack odds on here. 90 plus, Series 1, Series 2 Redux. Come on, give us at least a Series 2 Redux player. What? Dion Sanders, man. Let's freaking go. Dion Sanders. Oh, let me get a level 7. Okay. 7,500 coins, you know, I will take that. Oh my, how much is Dion Sanders selling for right now? He is he at least a million, right? At least a million? 1.1 million coins. Let's freaking go, man. Got to throw that up real quick. That's definitely our best pull all year. All year that is our best pull. Now the question is, guys, who do we use the power-up pass on? A 91 to 92 overall. So I, I could use it on Michael Vick, technically. I could... Uh, well, let's, uh, let's go hit up the auction block, man. This is a, it's a tough choice. Because technically, I should just use this power-up pass to sell somebody on my team and make a lot of coins. That, that should be the move. I think I have a really good team. Obviously, I could make upgrades on it. Like, I can't summon Randy Moss. He's a gnat. I could pick up Julius Peppers. I could pick up... Uh, could pick up Andrew Luck, man. I don't... I don't know. I really like Vic. But Vic is missing a lot of throws recently, and that Andrew Luck is so nice, at least not stat-wise. How does... Uh, I really want that Derek Carr, too. I could sell my Gronkowski. Could sell my Calvin Johnson. How much is limited time Gronk selling for? 790k. I feel like I, there wouldn't be a point to power up George Kill. Could sell my Gronkowski. I could sell my Calvin Johnson. Um, I can't sell Travis Frederick. It's not worth it for Gene Upshaw. I mean that's probably that's probably the move to swap out Gronk. It's like an extra nine hundred thousand coins right there. Honestly, switching out Gronk is probably the move, and Deion Sanders sold well. So I wanted to pick up one of the Mutt Ten players for my team, but I'm really liking JJ, even though I know Julius Peppers is amazing. Honestly, guys, I had a team of the week bundle for you guys to watch, but it was horrible. I mean, I figured, what's the point of you guys watching just trash packs? So as you guys can probably already saw, I did already go ahead and get Tyreek Hill. Did a couple games with him. It was nothing impressive. I feel like I just wasn't using him the way he should have been. Because, I mean, this dude's fast, but anytime he got open, the 87 speed safety would, like, catch up. It was kind of ridiculous. But, anyway, I'm going to try and get some more gameplay with him and hope you guys can see something with him. But, I mean, other than that, I think that's about it for the video. I honestly didn't like the Team of the Week packs this week. I didn't pull anything good. I think I pulled 86 Singletary last night. I think that was my best pull. But we'll do one right here for you guys. Hopefully maybe we can get a full one now that everyone's watching. I mean, we got 82 Preston Smith. Or Preston Williams. But anyway, guys. Thank you guys so much for checking out this video. If you guys like what you saw, make sure you guys hit that like and subscribe button. And let me know, Frill, down in the comments below, should I make coins off this power-up pass, or should I go pick up, like, Deion Sanders again? But, anyway, I'll catch you guys next time.